Sounds interesting. Mind if I join you? What ho? We meet again, vagrant of Inazuma. <laughs> My retinue and I were just... The first time the Millilith were present, I had to forego the chance to strike down Mondstadt's savior. This time was a perfect moment. I was mere seconds away. But who was that mage? She could not have known who I am. Perhaps her powers were real to her things unseen. Soldiers! Sir. Sir! Find them, and when you do... Another one? My lord! It's happening again. This is the largest one we've seen so far. They just keep coming, but so be it. Move out, change of plan. Your prior objective remains in force. Continue to research the meteorites. My lord, leave them to us. We will make short work of them. Are you deaf or just stupid? When did I give you the right to issue your own orders? My, my apologies, my lord. Now move out and complete your objectives as assigned. Any junior fortune teller could have told you this, but that man was a Fatui harbinger. That was too close. How did you manage to get caught up with a guy like him? A Fatui harbinger? Why, their wickedness knows no bounds. Whatever he was planning to do, he was heading straight for you. And he is an extremely powerful individual. I sensed it the moment I looked at him. He's far more powerful than you'd imagine. As much as it pains me to admit it. Surely his power cannot match that of the astrological genius of the century. I never said that. His strength may exceed mine by a hair's breadth. But in astrology alone, he doesn't come close. <gasps> This reminds Paimon of something. We ran into some Fatui at Wang Shuin too. What interest could the Fatui have in the meteorites? They must be plotting something. <laughs>